Hello guys, welcome back to Tenorshare channel. If your iPhone stuck on a screen like this, asking you to connect your iPhone to a computer, or asking you to connect to iTunes if you use iPhone 6 or earlier, they are both restore screen, which means your iPhone is in recovery mode. Let's get closer to see what it writes on screen. Support.apple.com slash iPhone slash restore. If you search this content on Google, you'll find out a page from Apple support asking you to use iTunes to fix this issue. Let's check out on iTunes. When you connect your iPhone to computer, there is a pop-up window showing that your iPhone is required to be updated or restored. Either of them takes a long time for waiting. And what's more, you may get your iPhone data loss. No worries, in this video I'll show you some efficient ways to quickly solve this problem without using iTunes. Let's jump in. The first way that's simply and worth to try is to force restart your iPhone. I'll take iPhone 12 as an example. You can check out this video to find out the way that suits your iPhone. So to force restart an iPhone 12 is to press and release the volume up, then press and release the volume down, then press and hold the side button. Now let's get started. Volume up, volume down, and hold the side button. Lose your finger when you see the Apple logo. But sometimes this method may not 100% work. Then here comes the second method. To fix the stuck with one click. Yes, you heard me right. There is such a tool that can help you exit restore screen just with one click. That is Tenorshare Reiboot, which can also fix more than 150 iOS stuck. You can download it via the link in description below if you have interests. Once downloaded, launch it. Here I suggest you to use the Apple original lightning cable to connect your iPhone to the computer for a more stable connection. On Reiboot, it shows that your iPhone is connected now. To exit restore screen is very easy. On the bottom right corner, click on exit recovery mode. And boom, just a few seconds, your iPhone will be saved and become normal again. If you tried this method, but your iPhone still stuck on the restore screen, don't be panicked. Reiboot can also help. Use repair function. Let's go back to Reiboot. And this time, click on the green start button. Here, as you can see, you can select the way you want to repair your device. If you choose deep repair, it will erase all the data on your phone. So definitely I'll recommend you choose standard repair to fix it first. Once you confirmed, click on standard repair button. Hit download to get the latest firmware of your iPhone. Once downloaded, click on start standard repair button. It usually takes you about 10 minutes to complete the process. So please be patient and keep your iPhone connecting while repairing. When it shows standard repair completed, that means your iPhone has been fixed successfully. Let's check it out. And yes, all the data are still on your iPhone. Congratulations. So this is the tutorial of how to fix iPhone stuck on restore screen. In this video, I've shown you three methods to fix this issue. If any of them helps, don't forget to give us a thumb up. I'll be grateful if you subscribe. See you in next video.